It was the night before Christmas. He lived all alone in a one-bedroom house made of plaster and stone. I had come down the chimney with presents to give and to see just whom in this home did live. I looked all about, a strange sight I did see. No tinsel, no presents, not even a tree. No stocking by the mantel, just boots filled with sand. On the wall hung pictures of a far distant land. With medals and badges and awards of all kinds, a somber thought came through my mind. For this house was different. It was dark and dreary. I found the home of a soldier once I could see clearly. The soldier lay sleeping, silent alone, curled up on the floor in this one bedroom home. The face was so gentle, the room in such disorder. Not at all how I pictured a United States soldier. Was this the hero of whom I just read, curled up on a poncho, the floor for a bed? I realized the families that I saw this night owed their lives to these soldiers who were willing to fight. Soon around the world the children would play, and grown-ups would celebrate a bright Christmas day. They all enjoyed freedom each month of the year because of the soldiers like the one lying here. I couldn't help but wonder how many lay alone on a cold Christmas Eve in a land far from home. The very thought brought a tear to my eye. I dropped to my knees and I started to cry. The soldier awakened and I heard a rough voice. Santa, don't cry. This life is my choice. I fight for freedom. I don't ask for more. My life is my God, my country, my core. The soldier rolled over and drifted to sleep. I couldn't control it. I continued to weep. I kept watch for hours so silent and still, and we both shivered from the cold night's chill. I didn't want to leave on that cold dark night, this guardian of honor so willing to fight. Then the soldier rolled over, in a voice soft and pure, whispered, Carry on, Santa. It's Christmas Day. All is secure. One look at my watch, and I knew they were right. Merry Christmas, my friend, and to all a good night. A most blessed Yule to all of my followers, subscribers, and to those whom I follow and subscribe as well. I hope your holiday is filled with all the joys that it could possibly bring. And I wish you all a most blessed new year. Until next time, remember, haunting dreams and blessed be.